I know most of us are watching other people's teams play today, but today is all they get. Tomorrow is yours, and every day after that, until your team is here, winning it all. This is about believing. Believing. So oh, Cleveland fans, is this getting to you? Because you are the target of a United Airlines Super Bowl ad, and it's not the only time you'll see Cleveland on the big screen on game day. Matt Rascone shows us one local group that's bringing Cleveland to a national audience. Cleveland, I know you're watching other people's teams play today. Cleveland may not have a dog in the fight this Sunday, but the city will get its seconds in the spotlight. Next season, you get the title, finally. The Super Bowl is advertising's biggest night. It's one of a handful of regions United Airlines is encouraging to buy early flights to next year's Super Bowl because, you know, there's always next year for Browns Nation. Because believing that hard can change everything. So we really wanted to have that inspirational message to get people excited, really the fans of the 30 other teams who aren't in the game. It actually worked, right? So you're like, oh, no change fees. Michael Goldberg is a professor of innovation at Case Western. The rates for advertising, not surprisingly, like much in life, have gone up every year. Um, and I think ultimately uh, advertisers are making that determination that for that exposure, it's worth it. Reports show a 30-second spot during the game will cost $7 million. And Destination Cleveland says they'll be there. Again, a place like Destination Cleveland, uh, to be on kind of a global stage with a very aspirational message, inviting visitors to, you know, see for themselves, is, is pretty powerful. Before Mike Jackson taught advertising at Kent State, he worked at companies like Pepsi and General Motors, where he worked on Super Bowl ads. It's very expensive, but I think the value is there when you look at just the global nature. And then you add the streaming component to it. It's just amazing. Destination Cleveland told me they're keeping their spot under wraps until game day, but they're excited to bring Cleveland to a national audience on what is one of the biggest media days of the year. We'll just have to wait for the big reveal on game day. Destination Cleveland also said they have been working to change perceptions of Cleveland for 10 years, and they said this new campaign will help build that momentum in a year, especially when we're expecting a lot of big events. Including a Super Bowl champion, apparently, next year as well. So <laughs> That's right. Keep hope alive. <laughs> yep. All right, Matt Rescone, thank you.